Hi guys, JP from FSI Panel. Just a quick video to show you how to change your root destination in the PMDG747. One user reported a crash to desktop when changing the root destination, so I tried myself and uh, I found I found it the hard way. Yes, it sometimes crashes. So I, I was looking for a solution and I found a solution. So I will share it with you now and please uh, report on the forum if you see that this solution is not working for you. Here it seems to work perfectly, so I will show you how to do it now. I will use the exact same scenario as uh, the user did. So it was an approach in uh, Washington on runway 19 left, and he wanted to fly a 15 miles final at the default altitude of 5,000 feet. So here everything is set, we're ready to move, so I'll push move aircraft. As always, remember FSI panel will not set your FMC, so you will have here Lima Fox Mike Lima as destination. This is normal and we need to change it. As well, a good thing to do is if you plan to fly several approaches in Washington or in any airport, you can create a snapshot. I will show you here as well how to create a quick shot snapshot once everything is set. Okay, so now as always, please do not touch anything until FSI panel tells you that you can take control. So the trimming phase run smoothly. I will just open the screens so we have a better view of what's happening. Okay, as you can see here on the navigation display, Lima Fox Mike Lima is the active destination and this is not what we want, so we will change it. So everything looks good, now we are coming close to 5000, the speed is set, so soon FSI panel here will tell us that we can take control, that's it. Please check all modes, set your FMC and all your brakes to start flying. Alright, so let's do that. So to change the destination, this is the way I found. Go to your next page and here type in the ICAO code of your airport. So in that case it's Kilo India Alpha Delta. And execute. Now delete Lima Fox My Lima, we don't need it anymore. And execute. So now you can see that we have this airport in front of us at 16 miles, so it looks good. Now I will put the runway, so arrival, we want to fly, ah sorry, I need to change now the, before you do that, so once we have deleted the Lima Fox Lima from the legs page, now we will change the destination of course, so we press root page, and on page one you have Lima Fox Mike Lima as destination. And here we will now put Kilo India Alpha Delta and execute. Now that this is done, we put the arrival. We have already the arrival here on top, so we just select ILS19 left. And I don't need any transition, execute. Leg page, now we see here on another display that Izumi is in front of us, so we'll go direct to Izumi and execute. Alright, so now everything is set correctly. We are ready to fly. You could set your minimum. So let's see, I want to set any minimum here. I will set the minimum as required. This is where I will do it now. And uh, once everything is done, what you could do now from this position is take a snapshot. So go to the side panel. Even if it's still frozen, position freeze, it's not a problem. Take your snapshot. I will call it here ILS19 left and uh, Kilo India Alpha Delta 15 nautical miles. All set. Enter. Alright, back to the simulator. We're ready to fly. So I hold my brake on the approach and that, there we go as you can see now glide slope is coming glide slope is on and the glide slope will be captured that's it glide slope captured thank you guys now you can fly your approaches and let's say now you would like to fly again this approach try again with a different weather how can we do it from now okay i will just close now p3d
All right, so now we had created this snapshot before I have restarted the FSI panel. I don't need to set any airports. I just have my previous aircraft there. I will select load snapshot. Take the snapshot that we have just set and select it. And now if I press move aircraft, it will fly with uh, the same weather, Cavoke weather. So we change the weather a little bit here. I will put a visibility of 3000 meters. And we're gonna put some winds, cross winds, 20 knots. And the QNH, just to try something else, I will set here 2998. Okay, and we're gonna put uh, overcast at 500 feet with light rain. I'm ready to go, we push move aircraft. And let's see what happens. Our flight is loading. So we are loading now a snapshot that we have just we just created a couple of minutes ago. Here we go. Altitude 5000. FMS is set. Weather is now set. Let's see the trimming phase. As you can see here, the QNH is in hectopascal because we saved the snapshot in hectopascal. If I, we should have saved the snapshot in uh, inch of mercury for um, Washington. Doesn't matter. We can just change it now, and we have it here 2998 as set. So now everything is done. As you can see, the weather has been changed. We have the crosswind 20 knots. QNH 2998. My FMC is set. The only thing I need to do. Arm the approach, hit the brake, and I have control, Traffic. and Traffic. we can fly the plane. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this uh, quick video. Please let me know if you have any other trouble uh, setting your uh, destination. Thank you, and as always, safe landing guys. See you.